Paula Raceway, riding dirt bikes, pretty cool, out here with Larry and our kids out riding the mini track, so uh, Lincoln and Hayden now uh, ripping it up on their little 50s, so pretty cool, come back out here, it's been a while since uh, we got to hang out and ride dirt bikes, so bringing it back to the roots, you know, bringing it back to where it all began, just having fun together, ripping it up, now our little groms are where we were when we were little kids growing up and they're roosting together, catching airs on the track. You know, like Militia is, is one big family. Militia, at this point, is growing so fast. And, you know, I want to keep it, keep it core and keep it real. And right now, it's uh, our team's so big. And, you know, we're coming out, you know, obviously always X Games, do tour, Nuclear Cowboy tour going on. And uh, some other tours over in Europe coming up. So freestyle strong. Like I feel like we've dominated freestyle forever, and and uh, still doing that. And you know, the company's venturing off into MMA, which is something I know Larry and I have always been fans of. And ever since way back in the day, where we had a fight gym in the garage, and actually used to have the underground fights and all that stuff. But nowadays, you know, it's a legit deal. Our MMA team's badass. We got champions on the team. I think that's a big direction for Militia. Myself, I can't speak for Twitch. I don't know what's going through his mind, you know? Like I said, everyone goes through their own little peaks and valleys. All we can do is be there to support Twitch for whatever it is that he decides to do and wish him the best of luck with his career and his line and whatever it is that he wants to do. But other than that, I mean, I can't really speak for what Twitch has going on. <laughs> it's true. I mean, it's... You know, every every man takes his own path, and you know, in the end, we're there to help him. When he, you know, when he was part of our group, you know, he's made a lot of his own decisions to do other things. So in the end, hopefully, you know, that works out for him and his family. And for us, we're moving forward. I think I think there's a fine line you ride when when a company grows to the size of ours, and it's like, uh, you know, there's always going to be the fans who say, oh, you guys are still all too, too corporate. But in the end, you know what? It's about building a brand and, and being able to, when you build that brand, give back to the sport, such as sponsoring the riders we have, being able to pay their bills, help them out with salaries, and I think that's what really matters, and helping foundations like the AFMXA and, you know, build, giving back to the sport, building jump parks, giving the guys a place to ride, you know, and I don't, I don't think that's selling out. I think that's like something that's building our sport, and in the end, through all that, I think we've kept it real. And we're still riding. Like, how many company owners can say we're out still laying it down? And and I think Militia is the most real company out there, and always will be. And yeah, you'll have your haters always, but really, it doesn't affect me. I don't even care. Yeah, and you know what? Like he said, exactly. Give it back to sport. And I mean, define selling out and going corporate. I mean, from day one, it's been world domination. We're supposed to come in and take over the corporation. So now that we're in a hierarchy in the corporation, now we're corporate, now we're just running the corporation. <laughs> exactly, we're changing the rules. So, you know, that's how it is. That's how Militia always has been. You know, that's how passionate we are for the brand, is we will go out and do poached ads, you know, with everything at stake, knowing that it's illegal, and being owners of the company, that the backlash is gonna fall on us, and we're gonna have, you know, huge consequences. It's not like a little slap on the hand for us, so we're putting a lot at stake to go out, I mean, how many other owners do you know that go out and, you know, break multiple, multiple, multiple laws to run an ad, you know, to keep their brand core? But uh, we're corporate, sellouts, whatever. Yeah.